Well, what's up guys? My name is Alan. I'm a Wix.com developer and in today's video, I'm going to teach you guys how to switch over to the Wix brand new category store, which is a brand new store upgrade um, for your Wix.com website. This brand new upgrade, it really comes with a ton of amazing features from category features, product features, product page features, filter features, uh, visual features. So there, there's quite a bit uh, that you're going to get in this brand new online store. So today I'm going to teach you guys how to go from the old store to the brand new store using your Wix.com editor. So with that, for, without further delay, let's get in, go ahead and get started. Let's go ahead and get right into it. So uh, go to your Wix.com editor. Uh, just make sure it's open. It's where you basically built your online store. From the left hand side, let's go ahead and hover over pages and menu and let us hover over something called the store pages. From here, you'll notice a little gearbox. Simply click on the gearbox and you'll notice a brand new option called migrate to category page. Just a disclaimer that this video is for those who are running on the old online store and want to get the latest features that Wix offers. If you do not see this category or migrate to category, then you most likely are already running on the latest online store. It's obviously recommended that if you are looking to run a business, I would recommend that you either reach out to a developer such as myself and a designer like myself. Uh, I am available via the Wix.com marketplace uh, where you can hire me to personally build out your online store and your product. So um, if you do not see this, um, upgrade here then you already are on the online store and that's what I recommend but let's go ahead and see what we can do when we do migrate so let's go ahead and click on migrate and once you do I'll see you on the other side from here once you have the brand new online store installed you'll be introduced to your store pages under something called your category page your category page is the very first page you'll be introduced to once you've installed the brand new online store from here, clicking on the category uh, page itself and clicking on the product category, category widget, you'll notice something called plugins and settings. Plugins is fantastic, but we're not going to talk about plugins just right now. Let's go ahead and click on settings. The first obvious upgrade uh, options you're going to notice is that the display section has completely changed. You can now choose to simply showcase your products or you can show breadcrumbs, which are little navigation underneath. You can choose to show a header section. From here, you can choose to show a description, an image, or a category title. Regardless, I personally like all these turned on. You can also show the total amount of product count that you have right here, which is really cool. You can also show, for example, add to cart features. You can choose to hover only add to cart features. These features are really great because they also apply when you actually click on switch to mobile. So let's go ahead into the mobile editor because I believe with so many users being on mobile nowadays, it's probably important for us to at least look at this once. From here, once we're inside the mobile editor, inside our category page, as you can see here, clicking on settings allows us to have so many new options. Again, my personal recommendation is that we go under layout and go under product grid. Most of you have a one by one product grid and this is fantastic. However, general e-coms, people like to consume so much content at a given point. So I recommend that we set up a two by two grid. From here, you can also go back to display and choose whether you want the breadcrumbs or you don't want the breadcrumbs. You can choose category, description, image, or header. Point is, is that we wanna to try to do our best to create the best online product. The product that users are gonna shop on, it's really important for us to get it right. So utilizing that display settings and the layout options is really going to uh, help you create that product you want. To be quite honest with you, there is no wrong answer. So for example, under mobile, under layout, under um, product images, we can choose a 16 by nine ratio. We can do a three by two, we can do a four by two, we can do a one by one. If you're having issues with images fitting, you can use the, crop, uh, the fit feature, which will guarantee your products to fit. Regardless, the point is, is that there isn't really too much to do programmatically. Rather, it's just a matter of setting up some options here that will help your Wix online store become successful. My recommendation is that you create the best filters that you can. So if, for example, we have a header right here, an image in the header. If you have multiple categories, you can notice that you can go into your Wix online dashboard. So go to your dashboard, hover over catalog, hover over store products, hover over catalog, and the categories that you've selected, you can actually choose the image you want to show per category, which is really, really cool. This video is a quick introduction. I'm going to go into a huge series into how to create amazing product pages, how to create layout pages, how to create custom search pages, and a bunch of other things. 
The last thing I can leave you with is to look at how to improve your product page. So let's go ahead and go into the actual store pages one more time and go to product pages. My recommendation here is to do the following. Simply click on the actual product page itself, click on the product, and let's go ahead and use something called the plugins here. From here, I want you to look at two plugins. Look at the first plugin and search for the first plugin under down here called the Wix product ratings and the Wix product reviews. The reason for that is you, it allows you to actually have a product rating right inside your Wix online store, which gives it a little bit of credibility and trust factor. From here, customers can also leave reviews, which is really, really amazing. Overall, I believe that the new Wix online store is faster, is visually more pleasing, has a ton of new mobile options, and has a big recommendation if you're going on the old store versus the new store. So I really hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Now before I go, I noticed a lot of you haven't subscribed. Consider subscribing. You can always unsubscribe later if you like, but I hope this video is part of a series that is going to assist you in helping create an amazing online store. So if you do see more of my content on the right hand side of your YouTube or the bottom, definitely consider checking out a lot of my content specifically related to SEO, local SEO, uh, and Wix SEO in 2025. So those three videos are a must watch, but definitely look out for the next video in this series on how to really create an amazing product page for your Wix.com website. Thanks a lot, guys. I hope you guys have a great day. Bye.